Nice to meet you. My name is Said, and I am an acoustic expert. In a sense, I am the golden ear of value. What does it mean? Well, for example, when you are in a car, you hear this, while I hear this. Now you understand better. Let's play a game. Close your eyes and listen closely. What do you hear? Easy, right? That was the sound of the turn signal. Did you know that these days, the sound of turn signal is actually artificial? About 40 years ago, it still existed because the technology was based on mechanics. But since then, thanks to electronics and the LEDs, the turn signal itself has become completely silent. However, you may be surprised to know that this sound is actually very important for safety. Drivers must remember to turn off their turn signal to avoid confusion other road users. That's why it has been added back, using speakers placed inside the steering wheel. Now, let's try something more complicated. I'm going to play two air conditioning sounds. One is validated by acoustic expert, and the other is rejected for your comfort. If you guessed the second one, you are correct. And if you couldn't tell, that's normal. This is where the acoustic expert came into play. But how do we do that? And how do we know which sound to reject and which one to keep? Sophie will explain everything. Over to you, Sophie. Thanks, Said. We're back where we started. And I'm sure you've been wondering, what is this place? This is an anechoic chamber. It is a special room totally isolated from the outside world and designed to reduce sound echoes. As you can see, it's made using materials that absorb sound waves. If you came inside an anechoic chamber, you might find it very strange to be in complete silence. Because this phenomenon never actually happens in real life. But for me, it's like a cocoon almost a getaway from the noise of everyday life. Just listen to the silence. So, let's talk about sound. What is it? Hard to describe, right? Well, literally speaking, it's a series of vibrations that travel through the air or other material, reaching our ears and allowing us to perceive them as sound. When an object vibrates, it creates waves that propagate through the medium, a bit like ripples spreading in a pond. These waves enter our ears, where they transform into electrical signals that our brain interprets as information. But how does one tell the difference between a sound and a noise? Well, to put it simply, if a sound in a vehicle may be disturbing to the user, it's a noise and must be improved. As you can imagine, it's a challenge to know if the use of new components will make a disturbing noise once put inside a car. So a good acoustic engineer is often forged by many years of experience. But our job is not only to identify the noise. To help us to find the source of the problem, we use some specific equipment. One of these tools is a microphone, allowing us to measure the noise level. And this one here is a mighty piece of technology called an accelerometer. It actually helps measure vibrations. And last but not least, we are going to introduce you to the longest standing member of the team, Joey, the artificial head. With two microphones in its ears, recreating human body influence, we are able to get a much clearer idea of what a user within a car would hear. Now that you know more about sound, back to Said to dive into the vehicle of the future. You must be thinking, what about electric cars? 
There is no noise to worry about, so we don't need acoustic experts anymore, right? So, the more quiet a vehicle is, the more we perceive every sound when we are inside. For example, the sound of switches seems much louder, but actually is not. Our job is to transform this noise into a sound. Now you know the importance of acoustic expert in everyday life. Our job is to reduce noise and vibration for your comfort. We ensure that every time you take your car, your experience is as pleasant as possible, whether you're the driver or the passenger. So next time you're inside your vehicle, notice how silent it is and think about the golden ears of Valeo.